Hey there, Ruckers. We're here today at the College Avenue Student Center for the second annual I Am Robeson Week Lecture Series in honor of Paul Robeson's legacy as a historical activist. Let's head inside to check it out. But I Am Robeson Week is our cultural center's signature event. It's our opportunity to center, um, center the narrative of Paul Robeson and the history of Paul Robeson so our students can get a more intimate examination and unpacking of who he was as a figure. Um, and instead of calling it just Paul Robeson Week, it was important to say I Am Robeson so that we can sort of see ourselves in his history and recognize that he is very close to us, he's near and dear. Paul Robeson is a uh... First of all, he's, he's an alum of this great institution, class of 1919. He attended Rutgers University, where he was an athlete, a scholar, and, and someone that fought against racial injustice uh, during a very difficult time in our country. It's important that we understand and recognize our history as a university community, that black students on campus and underrepresented students on campus see historical figures whose stories might align with theirs. Paul Wilson is one of the greatest men to ever attend Rutgers University. Uh, he was a man who did it all. He was an athlete, he was a singer, he was a writer. So he had so many talents that if I could just tap into one, I'd like to be great too. Paul Robeson was a hero. Um, he was a role model to me. The fact that he graduated Rutgers at the top of his class while earning 14 varsity letters, and also he was a great singer, he just represents the image of how a black man should be. So he was just a much inspiration to me and probably a whole lot of other people on campus. It's really important that we acknowledge um, the heroes of our past. Paul Robeson is someone who is widely under-recognized in our history books, someone that is traditionally talked about in um, African American or American history. And so it's important to unpack that history, relearn um, some of the history that, that we've yet to learn, um, and acknowledge him as a community. And so Paul Robeson's legacy is very critical to the early 1900s in terms of what he did to um, create a platform for others to speak out against um, injustice, particularly against racial injustice and oppression in our country.